American actress, voice actress, as well as model, Milena Markanov Kunis was born on 14 August 1983 in Chervenetsi, then in the Ukrainian USSR, who rose to fame with her first major on screen appearance in the television sitcom called That 70s Show in the late 1990s, and at the age of 14, co starring with Topher Grace, Ashton Kutcher, and Laura Prepon, and has steadily increased her fortune ever since. So, just how rich is Mila Kunis as of early 2017? Well, Celebrity.Money estimates that Mila's net worth is over $30 million, accumulated through her acting career and voiceover contributions over the last 20 years. Mila and her family migrated to Los Angeles, California when she was seven, where she studied at Hubert Howe Bancroft Middle School and then Fairfax High School where she took drama classes. She was involved in several TV commercials and minor roles in such films as Santa with Muscles with Hulk Hogan, Honey, We Shrunk Ourselves with Rick Moranis, and Gaia with Angelina Jolie. However, her big TV break came when she was cast to play Jackie Burkhardt in That 70s Show, which was launched in 1998 and ran for eight seasons, attracting an average of 11 million viewers and garnering 16 Primetime Emmy Award nominations, and winning three Teen Choice Awards. That was her career settled, especially as concurrently she voiced Meg Griffin in the popular animated sitcom created by Seth MacFarlane, Family Guy, from 1999, reputedly earning a respectable $15,000 per episode for her efforts, and helping the show to 12 Primetime Emmy Award nominations. The show also inspired the creation of a video game, a spin-off series called That Cleveland Show, as well as the publication of six books related to the series. Mila's big screen breakthrough came in 2008 with Forgetting Susan Marshall, since which she has appeared every year in productions, including with Jason Bateman and Ben Affleck in Extract, and in 2010, receiving a nomination for a Teen Choice Award for her role in The Book of Eli with Denzel Washington. That same year, she was nominated several more times, including one for the Golden Globe Award for her appearance in the highly popular film with Natalie Portman entitled Black Swan. More recently, Mila Kunis has worked with Channing Tatum in Jupiter Ascending in 2015, in Bad Moms in 2016, and is currently lending her voice to the animated amusement park. In her personal life, Mila Kunis had a rather public relationship with fellow teen star Macaulay Culkin from 2002, but eventually married former co-star Ashton Kutcher in 2015. They have a daughter and a son and are residents of Beverly Hills. <laughs>